Alright, welcome to another episode of Recast Fishing in SoCal. Today we are at Newport Beach and we're gonna be fishing bass. Bass and halibut. Halibut. And we've been kind of busy with our life and been off from YouTube for a while, but we're back. Yes, and uh, starting off today, we're gonna be opening up the mystery tackle box. inside uh just kind of cut it open real quick and uh what's inside what's inside ooh 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 that looks like a that looks like a a lucky craft but it's called a strike pro retail for 11.96 11.96 see pretty expensive it's worth the price i like it already and then a top water lure. Top water lure. That looks like a sculpin. <laughs> Some Some hooks. hooks. Nice. Oh, that looks sick too. It's a venom. Yeah, the bass plastic worms. Oh, that looks pretty crazy. That looks like a... What does that look like? I don't know. It has a little red tail. It's like a, like a two-sided worm. <laughs> <laughs> two-sided worm. It's like a little pumpkin seed, red red flake worm. And then there's a a little sticker in there too. I'll probably fit it on the back of my truck. Yeah, fish on. That's pretty cool. Great, can actually put on his truck. Is it clean enough? Oh, nice. Crazy. We'll see how we do today. All right, here we are on the water. Greg's gonna try drop shot first. There's a stingray in the water. Right there. Tying up right now with the eighth of an ounce swim bait that Colin one of uh, C4 Bassin's friends made. Let's see how it works. Good cast. Yeah, swim's good. Greg's on fish. And that is a spotty. Little, Look at the colors of them. I know, that thing is beautiful. Beautiful, it's beautiful, spotty. Nice. And who are we going to thank for this one? Colin. Colin's, swim bait. Colin's little swim bait. Looks like that one. It likes to spin around a little bit, but. Yep. Nice bass. And again, and again, who, who, whose rod and reel was this one? John's. <laughs> of course, of course, of course, like usual. Always my run. There you go. There, there goes. she goes. There's the bait. Would like to give a shout out, Carlin? All right. Can I use my own rod? <laughs> <laughs> I think you're gonna stop catching if you do that. <laughs> right where? Where was it? 
Oh, the pillar? Oh, okay. Ah. Yeah, I have I have my bait out there with my reel. All right, we are at our favorite dock. Greg's using his little lure, swim bait. Potentially seeing little fish fries in the water. Yeah, I see them. They're like all over the place. All right, fish on. What is this? What'd you get? Oh, what did I get? Mackerel. Mackerel. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> did I tell you cast it that direction? Yeah. That's actually a pretty good sized mackerel. Yeah. Come over here, we got a fish! Whoa! Time for the release. There she goes. <laughs> that was pretty cool. <laughs> Key was to downsize that lure. It's off a mega bait. Black. I think that's like a ancho? Like chrome? Chrome? We're closing out. Today we did pretty good. Uh, Greg got his bass. Got a mackerel. That was off a of mega bait. And it um, looks like that mega bait actually changes color in the water. It's kind of like a pinkish red color. It is actually um, very useful in these kind of conditions where you don't know what you're going to catch with. So, um, if you like our video today, give a thumbs up like and subscribe and hopefully we'll see you again on another episode of Recast Fishing in SoCal.